project. Now we find a problem which acts like every normal board dispatcher. Well, before I take you to the word dispatcher, I'd like my teammate, a teammate of mine, to just explain a term surrounding dispatcher. Hand and eye coordination. I don't think people actually know of this hand and eye coordination. It's the coordination and control of the eye movement and hand movement, and the processing of visual input to guide the reaching and grasping of objects. To break that down, hand and eye coordination is simply the connection between the brain, the eyes, and the hands, and how they work together to perform simple and complex activities. Now, I'll pass it down to my teammate to give you more information. Let's look at that negative story. I don't know, maybe we have all come across the movie called Harry Potter. Well, this is Daniel Radcliffe, also known as Harry Potter. In the year 2008, he revealed he had a mild form of dispatcher in his younger days. Now, what is this word of dispatcher? Well, I'm about to tell you. Now, what is dispatcher? Dispatcher is a developmental disorder of the brain, a child with causing difficulties in activities requiring coordination and movement. In other words, dispatcher is an illness which is like caused during the child, the childhood moments of an individual, which causes an individual to have difficulties in activities which require hand movement and also coordination. And also like activities like brushing teeth, with brushing his or teeth, then tying sugars, and also with balance. So those are the kinds of things which an actually suffered from during his childhood days. Now I want to pass it down to my teammate. Disabled with this Dispersion doesn't just affect people who are physically fit, it also has a hard hit on disabled people. Now, these people need special care when based in sports. As said earlier, we recall that hand and eye coordination is the connection between the brain, the hand, and the eye, and how they work hand in hand to perform simple to complex activities. Disabled with dispersion need a lot of care to improve more on their motor skills compared to those people who can make good use of their motor skills. Let me pass it on to my teammates to visit them. So after so many research and, uh, and ideas, we've got, we broke it down now to our innovation project solution, which is basketball. Basketball is an excellent sport which helps to improve one's hand and eye coordination. Basketball forces an individual to use his or hand and eye coordination to pass, shoot, and dribble while being dependent by opponents. Basketball doesn't only affect people with, with who are fit, but people that are, who are disabled. A disabled person, when is equipped with a wheelchair for shooting for sports, this is an evolved wheelchair with a streamlined body for speed and agility and a comfortable backrest. So, basketball starts with you. Basketball, I encourage everybody to start playing basketball because basketball has so many benefits. Basketball is actually good for your heart because it helps in cardiovascular endurance and agility. And basketball boosts mental development. It makes you more mentally sharp because it, it helps you to play without thinking. Everybody should play. Everybody should play basketball because even if I, even President Barack Obama played basketball as part of his fitness regime. So let's pass it up to our Okay, then we have the model drawing of basketball. So the other what we're saying is actually centered on this. Then basketball is a basic basketball court that has that's within an estate. So. If anybody in the estate uh, has maybe during the visual time can just come to the court and play and get fit. So it's encouraged for everybody to play basketball because it has a lot of benefits. So uh, we share uh, this innovation project and the solution with everybody in our school, the students and the staff of the school. So we got feedback and we and therefore we through the feedback. We endeavor our principal to get us a basketball court so that the students can be trained and know what basketball is all about so that everybody will be fit and at least it's been an encouraged point to so the great at which basketball is played will grow also in Nigeria. So that brings us to an end of our innovation project. Briefly, I have to discuss the ball by the way, I just don't know from just about time. Then, having fun has been, our, has been one of our major key to our team formation. We make sure that everything we do is not just based on seriousness, we had fun and make every moment lively and we enjoyed ourselves throughout the course of all the season. So we want to say a big thank you to Kuderina, SAP and everybody that sponsored this program. We are highly honored and privileged to this program. I want to say a very big thank you. Thank you very much for everything.